I want to direct your attention to Luke chapter 6, verses 37 to 42, where, as throughout this week, we're hearing words that have to do with forgiveness. And in verse 37, Jesus says, Do not judge, and you will not be judged. Do not condemn, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Uh, Jesus here, talking about, in some ways, three aspects of a similar dynamic. Do not judge, do not condemn, and forgive. And in every case, there is a reciprocity, if you will, right? Don't judge other people, and you will not be judged. Don't condemn, and you will not be condemned. So often... Um, things happen in life and we have make assumptions. We make judgments uh, that turn out not to be correct. Uh, we condemn other people and we don't know the whole story. And it's, it's really something how that happens. Recently, someone was telling me a story about uh, how they had to go for a medical test. They had to go for an MRI and they were sitting in the waiting room. And sitting in the waiting room, they struck up a conversation with someone else who was there and then another person came in. There was a third person in the waiting room. And even though that person was the third person to come in, when they came out to call someone to come back, they called that person who had waited the least. And the person who was sharing this story with me said she was a little like, hmm, you know, we were both here first. And then when she got called back, it turned out that the other person needed a more complicated test. It required a dye and all this stuff, and so it took longer time to prepare. And so naturally that person had to go back first because she had more time before she could have the MRI down. And the person sharing this story with me just related, here I was making an assumption, and you know why do we do that, right? So do not judge, and you will not be judged. Do not condemn. And you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Throughout this week, as we've talked about this petition in the Lord's Prayer, forgiveness is the only one that's a conditional request. It's the only one that comes with a promise that if you do this, if you do A, then B is going to happen. And it's just so important with forgiveness to understand if we want it for ourselves, we need to extend it to other people. And every time we extend forgiveness to other people, the person we're helping the most, the person we're freeing the most, is ourselves. And that's part of the dynamic. And if you continue to look at these verses in Luke 6, 37 to 42, Jesus goes on then to talk about give. And the measure that you give will be the measure that you receive. And how God will bless us in an overwhelming way. And I don't think it's a coincidence that that comes after don't judge, don't condemn, forgive and give, and God will bless.